guys so today we're gonna start basically with hype rap i'm super excited to start doing this series on this great framework i've been playing around with it all weekend and i think it's time for you guys to get introduced to this right so these are the prerequisites automatically just before we jump into this number one you need to have an idea of what programming languages are <laughs> and I, I say that just to be funny but um at the same time some people they just don't know what the hell they're doing so this is their first time looking at a framework or looking at javascript so if you have any type of idea of programming as far as javascript then this framework is for you it's pretty simple pretty easy all right now second thing that we need is adam a text editor it doesn't matter if it's visual studio code it doesn't matter if it's brackets if it's vim whatever floats your boat okay it's that simple it's up to you then the second thing that we want to do is you want to come to github.com slash coding face.com right and that's gonna bring you here see that boy right there there you go dab on them okay <laughs> now so we're gonna come here and click start a kit all right this is my starter kit this is how I start all my tutorials right I always come here so you either could download it or you could clone this all right so for me right now what we're going to do is we're gonna download it okay yes it's that quick all right now I'm gonna come here to my downloads folder I already downloaded this like 30,000 times so it's okay <laughs> I'll do it one more time we're gonna come to projects and we're gonna say move that in there that's my project I have a folder named projects you can put it in the desktop you can put it wherever you want wherever you host all your files it's up to you okay then from there we're gonna have here started kit 2018 I'm gonna name this hyper hyper I don't know hyper app uh yeah hyper app styles I don't know hyper <laughs> I don't know what to name this because I already have a hyper app folder hyper hold on let me name this original all right for you guys just name it hyper app all right make your life easier yeah what a dash okay there you go okay so we're gonna come in here and what we're gonna do is we're gonna come with Adam and we're basically going to come here open up a project go to hyper dash app all right cool then what we're gonna do is the first thing is pretty much come here delete everything that's inside of first comp delete that because all of that stuff is for react all right delete that and here let's create let's rename this let's say hyper all right let's just name it hyper regular js we could delete this we don't need it either okay we're gonna come to uh what is it webpack yeah webpack we're going to comment this out all right for now and then we're going to delete this here we leave the comma we name this hyper and then here we say index that js okay we save that all right we're good now we're gonna follow the instructions from here so what we're going to do is we're going to make sure we install all of these things here so Oh, let's copy this one we're gonna come here to Adam if you guys don't have this on on your Adam make sure you install a package called terminal 
it's like id terminal so you could have the terminal right here inside of atom so here we're going to say npm i uh was it dash dash save and then we're just going to make sure we add all of these i'm pretty sure some of them are already there but it's okay it's not gonna hurt you to to basically install it one more time sorry i apologize it's, it's not these right here we need these <laughs> okay so this one uh i think i already have it do i let me start it all over npm install dash dash save that one copy this that one that one that one oops god damn it <laughs> and webpack <laughs> all right let's see what happens click that and then technically it's going to install all of them and save it to the package.json all right and then all we really want to do after that is we're just going to add this this plugins and that's it then we're ready to do some hyper app okay also so we, we need to install hyper app <laughs> by the way <laughs> Okay, npm install hyper app. There you go. Hyper app, add it. Okay, now we copy this. What says plugins? We copy this here. And then we go to the Babel RC paste this here now we should be fine let's try this out let's copy this into our index.js okay hyper index.js okay paste this this is just setting up guys I know it takes a little while but once we're set we're good we're good to go okay we gotta edit this here uh, let me see we could actually come here and change the vendors but we're gonna leave it like that for now so on this what we're going to do is name this uh, what is it hyper we have to change this I keep forgetting this so we got to name this whatever we want that file to be named so hyper app for now let's just name it like that hyper app or not, you know what hyper <laughs> name it hyper okay and then here let's remove this this comments and let's add hyper to this one or well, hyper app to the vendor so what this is going to do is going to take when we install hyper app it's going to put it into the hyper uh, file the vendor file <laughs> oh god all right let's do this this is good okay let's do npm run watch let's see if we get some errors if we got some errors well of course we're gonna get some errors yeah let me see try running npm install gulp okay so we don't have gulp in this are you serious no it should be there let me see what's going on what's going on kids okay npm install and that's because we didn't run npm install at first so now this is going to install every single thing that we need 
you know, from our package. Of course, I have a lot of stuff that you don't need for this app. So when you see stuff like for React, you could take it out at some point. You know, it's up to you guys. I'm just setting you guys up the easiest way, the fastest way to do this. Okay. All of that's being installed. All of that's running. Okay, let's see what's the issue here. Okay, no issue, I guess. Or is there? God damn it, Node. Ever since I, <laughs> I installed the latest Node, it's been giving me issues. I don't know why. Let me see, error handling, eval. Okay, library SAS, expand. It's installing a lot of stuff. Yeah, I usually just fast forward to this, guys, but it's all right. You guys could, you know, take the pain with me of doing this right now, <laughs> of this massive install of packages right now. Come on. Come on. This has never taken this long. I swear to God. <laughs> Where are all this stuff coming from? Okay, building. Wow. I did not know this was going to take this long, guys. Seriously, it was supposed to take five minutes. That's it. <laughs> My God. Yeah. <laughs> I should have just used yarn. I'm sorry. I apologize. Um, cool, but it's fine. We went through that pain. Now let's run NPM. NPM run watch. Okay. Let's see. Hey, everything loaded fine. That's fine. Okay. Now let's see if there's an error. Console log this. Okay. Components hyper not found. So let me see if this got sent. Components hyper is there. Okay, let me see first. Let me look into this. What is it? Okay. JS components hyper. Gotta put the extension. Come on, son. <laughs> All right. So yeah, now it says hi. So right now we're ready to go and we're good to go, kids. All right. Put this here. Put this here. Move this up. Bring this down. And now we can just come here, you know, and play around with this real quick. So what you're seeing here is like JSX, right? And a whole bunch of ES6. Me on the next video, few videos that I'm gonna make for you guys, I'm gonna make it a little bit more clear for everybody. Because there's like, you know, if you're not really used to ES6 like that, then you might be like, wait, what? You know what I mean? But yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. I hope you guys follow through with this tutorial is pretty cool man I'm, I'm really loving it right now i'm really loving this hyper app it's like a new thing it's like a whole new world for me you know so i'll see you guys around bye this is your boy joe back at it again i didn't did it again man i came up with this new course hyper app js course guys if you want the full course and you don't want to wait for the videos on youtube make sure you go to the website 
you know, codingface.com is going to bring you here to the store. There's going to be a whole bunch of courses. Of course, you could just sign up for the get all access pass. And yeah, whenever you use the description below and you use the link through there, guys, you're going to get 50% off. All right. I'll see you guys later. Bow.